We work with grape growers as well as wineries as well as winemakers which allows us to have flexibility in selecting different wines for the different teams. I was actually watching what was happening at the stadiums with celebrity chefs coming into play and all of the um, reconstruction that was happening for sweet holders and also the general fan. You were seeing that they wanted to move away from just the basic fare to deal with the taste profiles of the, the fan. We are the licensee of Major League Baseball and we are looking to roll out um, 20 teams this year. We've been trusted by Major League Baseball to develop quality wines and bring them to the teams. As we continue to evolve our um, relationships with the teams individually, we get them more and more involved in the tasting and the label design and really picking the wines. This first rollout was really to illustrate to the teams and to Major League Baseball that we can help guide that process and identify some great wines. And thankfully the Reds were very excited when we presented the Pinot Noir Monterey California 600 case um, release. Very happy with both the design as well as what was in the bottle. And in the club series we picked a Cabernet to start. Pinot Noirs have been getting more and more popular. So we knew that we could bring this wine into this market specifically too because of the excitement around the team and have the fans and the, the um, Reds embrace the product. So what we do hope to do, so we really went with the tried and true Cabernet. As you said, Cab is king. Um, but what we wanted to do, and with this wine, it is, um, it is a great fruit to the wine but it's not an overbearing, high tannic wine. So people, we wanted people to be able to drink this now and not necessarily worry about food pairing. Um, so we were able to get a really nice fruit forward Cabernet that we could introduce as this first uh, release as part of the club series. As we move forward, we might pair a white with the Cincinnati Reds Red.